Oh, uh, we're gonna respawn. <laughs> we have to come back down here to get our runes. Oh, man. It's 18,000. It's not even fucking worth it. Oh, I'm going to get him. I lost my other I mean, fucking 18. <laughs> I lost everything that we came into this fucking cave to get. Yep, exactly. I lost it all. So broken. That fucking rejection spell. I 10 bitties really for spray? Me. Fuck yeah, let's go. Especially when you're surrounded <laughs> by <laughs> motherfuckers that just swinging. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> they would show up next to me and just get knocked down. I stun locked one guy, I hit him three times. Get fucked. <laughs> <laughs> All right, time to reset my fucking spells. That one. I'll fuck you. 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 Uh, I swear to God, I really hope we don't have to fight any more of these invisible bitches. <laughs> Such a pain in the Same. ass. I'm gonna rest. Hey. And Gandalf says, Congratulations. Thank you, Gandalf. Thank you. Thank you, Shane. We also, put our Gandalf. Heart and souls into this. Fucking square up, my dude. How does this shit work? That's what I, oh my god, I almost the, fucking died again. The veil that we got. Let me throw. What is it? Uh, it says, Conceals the wearer when crouching away from enemies. Hmm. I do not feel very concealed. <laughs> like I'm getting stabbed. Ow. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how this works. So Jeez. proud of you for not dying. Hmm. <laughs> Gee. <laughs> uh, completely conceals the wearer's presence while crouching at a distance from foes. Right at a distance. But like, yeah. how much is the distance? Well, outside or inside? <laughs> Okay. We finally cleared this goddamn cave. Fuck this cave. Fuck this shit, I'm out. Mm -hmm. I got what I needed. 19,000, let's go. 19. And... Lucky. <laughs> Woo! I'm a huge fan of being able to eat fucking attacks. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean, that since it is nice. Since my strength is so high, I've started putting stuff into my health, but that's dude, not the real strength man. build way. A true. I just don't want to be fucking literally a bee's dick after getting hit by a flying fucking moth, you know? But that's where all the fun is. <laughs> no. Yeah, so that's how you know if you're any good at the game. Is that a Dorito with tentacles? Is that a dream of mine? Yes. <laughs> it's cheesy tentacles. I'm pretty sure if you go, uh, you know, to the eastern part of the world, they probably have that dream for you on VHS. Uh, enjoy. Oh, probably. <laughs> Why did you pick a fight with the fucking, like, Death Star flower? Because I have black flame. Uh, fair. Yeah, these these things have horrible ass returns. Like they're so fucking bad. Yeah. It's what like three fifty or some stupid shit. Some whack shit. Don't worry, I'll help with blood flame. <laughs> More flame. Yoga flame. I will stand as lookout. Cooking these fuckers alive. <laughs> I'll see, no, yeah, we're dealing with shit ton of damage. About time, though. <laughs> Flame Boy trademark. <laughs> and this is good. There we go. His name's Charlie, and I love him. I mean. Flame Boy is way cooler yeah. than Wet Willy. <laughs> as much as I like Wet Willy, yes, I have to agree that uh, Flame Boy. Is way better than wet willy. I mean, I like my oh, willy to be guy? wet, devil? not to be wet willy. Devil man? Uh, I'm not sure. I, yeah, I just know the devil part of it for sure. Yeah, there's something devil. Wait, those dudes, are those dudes crouching on top of that thing? They yeah. sure the fuck are. Yeah. They just post it up. Oh, and then there's more of them right here. This is where we came from. I think to the left is where we came from. 
Uh, oh, that engaged. They're a little tanky. All right, well. Holy shit! What the fuck? He nailed that front flip. <laughs> right? <laughs> Ow! What the fuck? You had a stroke? You alright? Bro. <laughs> Get away from me! Fucking Mike and Ike are getting them. Right? <laughs> they were fucking laced with something. Laced with sugar. Ow! Laced with some bitchy knees. Ow. My back has arrived. Aha. Uh -huh. They get 1100. That's not bad. I did not mean to summon them. We still got more we can fight, so it's not worthless. I hope oh, someone yeah, here is friends. I've seen friends, but it's been a long yeah, time and I wasn't player. like <laughs> the <laughs> biggest <laughs> fan. So as a reference, I probably wouldn't know. You can hug that giant arrow. Dip, there's, there's, there's a couple that I would, though. There were a couple decent what? scenes. I missed. I was more into like oh, God Becker and Fraser and shit yeah, like I'll that at that time. Like that that was more along along my lines. Know. Holy fucking lag, what? That was wild. Fireball. Oh my god, I'm Stun gonna lock. die. I'll spun his ass. Stun. Yeah, the fireball stuns the fuck Stun. out of him usually. <laughs> I kinda like this fireball. This black flame is sick. It's fucking evil for sure, but. Sick. Yoga flame. Whatever, bro. If they're dead, they're dead. Yeah, right. I don't care how they got there. <laughs> evil, good, dark, light. Death is a death. Oh, it's two more. Where? Oh, it's all over there to the left. Straight oh. southeast. Two wandering soldiers. Wandering bitches. Eat fireball. Dink. I missed. Dink. Give in the knees. Tag you it. Oh, you well, give a shit about it. I tagged you again. Ha ha. You have oh, to take me twice. Oh, no. <gasps> now you have to take me three times for me to be it. Oh, I'm Fuck this one guy. One. Fireball. Fuck this guy. Pop his ass with some magic. Nah, you got it. <laughs> Damn. Magic bitches. It's really easy Damn, if you just 000. fucking ride your horse back and forth. They just can't touch you. They just look at you like, oh, I'm gonna come get you. No, you're not. Ooh, what's that? Oh, that's a fucking hole in the ground. Oh. It's an elevator. A hole in the ground. The traction's not moving. Okay, oh, there's another way down there. Um, oh, yeah. I know exactly what yeah. it is. Oh. Gravity. <laughs> That's way... I have gravity magic, but even that won't save us. <laughs> That's way farther than I expected it to be, so... Um, <laughs> have fun, Spray. Wait, wait, wait. Let me try something. Does anyone have Feather Faller? I, I hear Armored. Oh, it's a soldier. Uh, yes, I do, actually. I'm sure that's not gonna help. Oh, probably not, but I'm not gonna use that. I'm gonna use this. Well. <laughs> Didn't even make it halfway down. <laughs> well, All right. what about this supposed, one? That's supposed to like mark the distance, right? Well. <laughs> the light will cushion my fall. No. I didn't even touch the bottom. <laughs> you didn't touch the bottom. You just died. <laughs> well. <laughs> oh my god. I can lie to you, bro. I'm not really sure definitely. how I got here. I mean, yeah, guaranteed. I don't know how I got here either. Oh, there's a grace right here. Did we activate the sick? Nope. I'm sitting at a grace. Oh, we just probably respawned those dudes. Oh well. Yeah. Whatever. Welcome. Alright, I've got some broom fives. Let's see how much that is. 3,000. Shit. That's I've got a lot. Room ones. I've almost got enough for a level up. About another 15,000. Kill fucking 15 more of them big chunky boys and, and you're chilling. Jesus. Oh, we got wolves. 
How how do we get down there? I'm not seeing anything on the outsides of the map. Yeah, it looks like we're just on a sheer cliff edge to death. I didn't even notice that fucking oh. thing there. Ooh. The ash guys. Ash no barons? Recycling in ash barons right now? No, the guys that give us ash of war. Huh. Sacred order. Oh, hell yeah. That's probably garbage. Wow. I miss that time that they would just die and we would get shit. That was fun. <laughs> Ooh, ruins. There's always a little mini boss or something here. Oh, there's a dungeon nearby. Ooh. Oh, yeah, there is. The dungeon. Perfumers ruins. Oh, I don't like the perfumers. Oh, God. Oh, God, get the fuck away from me. <laughs> I'm sure curious I about what raid Fire. brought me here. Perfume uh, bottle. There wasn't a raid. At least not but that I know. saw. So if there was one, I am very much lost. Fucking flowers. Help. There's a lot of poison everywhere. What do these guys have ow. blast power? Fucking ow. They're perfumers. They're, they, they make bottles and they're like, they make the stuff and they drink and drinks and... Yeah, but they're the flowers. They have little bubbles. Yeah, because the perfumers, ah. I think they have like a... Bitch. A thing of magic or whatever, where they put it on other people. Bitch. Followed from a raid at one point. Oh my uh, god, that almost yeah. just fucking one shot me? Uh, Holy shit. Maybe OD. Yeah. And maybe... it is fucked my frames. No joke. Maybe. Uh, for somebody. I don't fucking know. No. Fuck you, you stinky perfumey bitches. Nobody likes Macy's. Ah, where are you I, feel, I feel like the, the SpongeBob <laughs> episode with they. Not through the perfume department. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, damn. Omen Killer Gear? Wait, did you guys see the final show? Code name? Uh, well, Omen Killer? OD I think is picked it up off Overdose Omen 69. Killer. Oh, I was like, I got their full set. Um, oh, did you? And then yeah. Meatball is Mr. Like Meatball. Uh, oh, it was back this way? I don't know if it was from, like, Spray Fart or somebody. I don't know. You've been here for, for a little bit, though. Like, yeah. right here. Oh, yeah. You've been here what? and there and everywhere. Oh, I got this well, he didn't give me weapons. It's not fun. <laughs> Taste fire. Let's leave them all just... one shot. <laughs> red lightning and holy. Oh, God. These things just fucking reminded me. Uh, my catering it's manager whatever. at work said that she would rather sniff someone's fart than the smell burning leaves. Wait, what? Burning leaves isn't even that bad. Burning leaves is delicious. It's one of the best scents ever. Like, why it's would you rather... Pleasant. Yeah, why would you rather sniff a fart? Oh, Adam Adam. How that hurt. Yeah. Like, bruh. Stop, stop, stop being stupid. Nerd. Oh, oh, what the flowers. shit? Oh, I'm on fire! Fireball. Fireball. What's that? Perfume bottle. Fireball. <laughs> Just chucking fireballs out of <laughs> Fireball. Fire. I recognize Just those names. I don't know. You're me now. Yeah, that's fair. That's fair. Great. Um, nice. Was it Mojo so dope? I don't give a fuck. Try to poison me all you want. Fireball. Does it look like I give a fuck? Oh, Miranda sick. I got the fucking too. omen killer shit. Oh, okay. Yeah, you found it too. Yeah. Oh, yeah. oh big plants. <laughs> that, that, the that omen is, killer stuff doesn't really look like it's that good. From, then. It's more just for looks, probably. Moto, yeah, Moto's dope. Obviously. Hence the name. It's decent against, like, lightning and holy damage, though. Ah, uh, okay. That's not too bad. Eh. Eh. Oh my god. He was oh, in here a little bit spray. earlier too. He fired it. Like more towards the uh like prior to the Elden Ring stuffs. Fire. Taste unholy fire. Bitches. 
call us the Weed Whackers. Holy flowers. Guess what? They're all getting sold. Nascent buddy. Triple kill. T -t 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 Triple kill. I have enough Bro, for level up. You know that dude from, from the fucking Halo shit? He does, um, like, paid things on that one, like, little, like, voice line site or whatever. You can pay celebrities to say stuff for you. And somebody was like, big jiggly titties and shit like that. It's <laughs> like, fuck yeah, dude. Like the announcer? What? Yeah. yeah, one of them, I remember the multiplayer announcer. He was like, mommy yeah. milker. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that shit. Bro, it's so cool. <laughs> That guy is fucking rad, man. And he's like 80 or some shit. He's mad old. Jesus. Ooh. Boost ally attack power and reduces incoming damage once. Literally in his name, this is nature to be dope. Exactly. He's fucking cool people, bro. I can do Mojo's use FP dope. to scatter sparks in a wide cool area. Piece. I think that's what these guys do. Uh, Mommy milkers? What? Milkers. Got the mommy milkers. Mm -hmm. Give me milkies. <laughs> oh my god. What's up? You gotta get mix it up so you can just have a random like quote <laughs> and it's just all your quotes just in a randomizing. I I we need I need to find a grace. I need to use this level up before I die. Yeah. We passed like three of them coming here, didn't we? Maybe. How's, how's it going, Michael? I, was, I didn't take much. I think if we hug this left wall, we'll eventually find another one. <laughs> when in doubt, oh, hug the left wall. The McDonald trick. McDonald I'm trick. calling it that from now on. We definitely talked about this before, but I don't remember what the fuck that is. And it just sounds so, so fucking creepy. There was a McDonald's movie. It was like live action and animated. It was to go back and forth. And in yeah. one of the movies, they get caught in this maze. And they're like, how are we going to get out? I don't remember mm. who said it, but somebody was like, I know. Just Probably your Grimace. Left hand to, like, stick your left hand, put it on the left wall, and never take it off, and you'll eventually get out. Because if there's Which no is skin, untrue. And that is untrue. Because if they if they make the the maze in a way that you get stuck, like if you only put your left hand there, you could end up just walking your left hand up against the wall and then going like around in circles. As long as they don't mm -hmm. put a little individual block by the wall that leads to nothing, there's got to be a way to get out by just putting your left hand on the wall. Got to. Or walk through the walls of the maze. Oh, yes. Let me just phase right through existence. <laughs> yeah, just be like oh, Homer. Just, maze on yeah. fire. Well, yeah, there's there's that. But just be like Homer. Just just phase yourself into the shrubbery. The shrubbery. Yeah. I require <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> Or burn it down. <laughs> <laughs> it was Ron McDonald himself who said he had an uncle who told him to put their left hand against the wall. Oh, okay, so it was Ronald. Mm. Yeah, so that trick uh, works. Um, I just kind of want to watch that movie because it was yeah, actually pretty good. Mm. I don't know. Let's to my knowledge, I haven't seen like any trailers for any movie that I actually wanted to watch in like the last 15 years. Everything just looks like fucking ass. Yeah, uh, nothing looks too good. Actually, you know what? I lied. I literally just lied because there's one movie I do want to go see right now coming out in fucking theaters. And I'm not allowed to say the word because it is bannable. <laughs> okay. Uh, so, uh, what's it about? We'll, we'll, we'll just say Wizards in Paris. Because, um, yeah, it, it's a spoof movie of Harry Potter, but gotcha. it's Wizards in Paris. Understood. Where the fuck do we go? Um, anywhere but here. Do we, uh, we have 
the divine bridge to get into the city. Do we just want to warp there? Uh. Well, I mean, we could go try to get the the map real quick with the area. Yeah, okay, we should yeah, probably so we'll go do to that. the Altus Highway Junction then, directly south of the map. Oh, what the hell? Ancient dragons. dragons! <laughs> what? Holy you the whole shit! You'll eventually find your way out. Exactly. They're shooting a lightning. Like if you're panicking, Fuck that's you. a good way to just be like, I can get out. He's holding. He's using it as a sword. Oh my god, this dragon's cool as shit. This dragon. Oh, this dude is mad cool. Ugh. This dude really oh, reminds me of the fucking oh the other dragon, the time She's dragon. Away. How nice. much mana does he cost? He's overpowered. Fuck. <laughs> Weird. He only costs We're six. dealing no damage. Six! Oh my god! He costs six neutral mana. He's a 15 15 for six? 15 Wizards. 15 with fucking. What is that? Uh, the thing that the Eldrazi have. Oh, Ooh, Annihilator? He's got like yeah, Annihilator 10. Annihilate 9. Annihilate 9. <laughs> I'm feeling it. <laughs> <laughs> my bro's got haste and double strike. Oh my Ooh. god. He's sick and reach. Reach. Oh no, he's got flying. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, Gandalf said she. She has double strike and flying. <laughs> I am Blue running Blue. the fuck away from these things. Half of her? Yeah, fuck that. Oh my god. See, how the fuck do I find tempered bitches? I do expeditions and can't find any tracks. I believe we have to beat the game first, Michael. Oh my god, and I don't have health bars, right? But I'm technically in combat, so I can't open them at. Cool. <laughs> don't worry, guys, I got it. This is not gonna work out. <laughs> You're the I'm one one it. soldier token with a dream. <laughs> <laughs> He's got a basilisk collar. He'll be all right. <laughs> Where's my dark steel axe? You gotta res this, Casper. Oh, fuck, you're both dead. All right, well. Yeah, we can't teleport. <laughs> do, 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 do. There's one like over here, right? In there. Yeah. yeah it's not worth it. No yeah. runes. Whack. Yeah, he literally just. I thought we only had to beat. There you got the. No, 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 no. I believe we have to beat the game at least until we can start getting tempered investigations. The American Society of Magical Redacted looks interesting, but I'm pretty sure Casper mm -hmm. is going to see it for different reasons. No, you're a bitch. <laughs> it's a spoof movie. <laughs> I like spoofs. I like, what the fuck? What was the 300 one? Like, that... Meet the Spartans or something? Meet the Spartans, yeah. Yeah, I love all those dumbass movies. Oh, <laughs> oh you spawned up there. Oh, shit. And now I have health bars. Don't worry, Casper. I'll spoof on you. Hmm. Is that a promise? Yeah. Hell yeah. Two shekels for your effort. I don't want to fight these guys. That is a mad cool ass dragon, and I hope to God we never fucking see him again. We'll beat him this one day. This is terrifying. We'll day. Resting. Spray's still uh, up actually. there in the fucking weeds. <laughs> we don't have too much more to go. Michael, I think after we beat this round of Elder Dragons, then we just have to beat one more dragon, and then we technically beat the game. Well, I can't open my map. Where are we going? Why are you under Altus the dragon Highway pussy? Junction, directly underneath the map spot. Should we have this directly one? South. The last movie oh, yeah. I watched the years was Twilight Breaking Dawn. <laughs> Hell no. Let me go take a piss real quick. The Twilight movies okay. can suck my dick. They're so bad. So, so bad. bad. I'm pretty sure I've said the story before on stream. Uh, I mean, the Spartans, but not hills have eyes. <laughs> oh. Here's the, the lowdown, right? So I had a really bad fever, like real bad. I was super dizzy, super nauseous, and I'll I was that up in a second, OD. And I was on the couch, uh, just resting. And uh, my mom is like, are you okay? I was like, yeah, I'm like I'll make it. So she's like, okay, I'm gonna put on a movie. And so she puts on the first Twilight. I got about 30 minutes in and then I was like, I can't do this anymore. So I crawled my, I like fell off the couch and I crawled my way upstairs. I dragged my way upstairs to get away from that movie. <laughs> it was miserable, but I did what I had to do. Oh my God. 
Oh, oh, hey, I found the guy who sells incantations. OD's bringing up an oldie but goodie thing from way back in the day when I played <laughs> fucking Banjo Kazooie on stream. And there was this whole thing for like a week where it was like X thing or watch Hills Have Eyes because I think personally Hills Have Eyes is a mid movie. I never said it was bad, but it's mid. <laughs> it doesn't hold up over time. I'm sorry. There's, there's better shit. And now he's like, meet the Spartans, but not Hills Have Eyes? Would you rather watch <laughs> Twilight or Hills Have Eyes? And guess what? My fucking answer is kill myself. But if I can't do that, <laughs> I don't Fair care enough. because I'm taking a nap. I will sleep through both of them. I am going to sleep. Yeah. Or <laughs> any. kill any dragons to beat the game. Got it. Oh, says agreed. Do. Twilight success. <laughs> yeah, Twilight's so bad. Like, I've only been button. asked to fucking watch it one time, and I was like, uh, no. And then there's a fucking ghost up on that ridge that looks very spooky, and might might have stuffs. Uh, uh, hold on, I'm over here getting the uh, the map. Oh yeah, I should probably do that, right? Uh, and then my fucking eighth grade science teacher was like. You like vampires and stuff, right? Yeah. You should you should read Twilight. And I was like, I mean, vampires sounds cool, whatever. I got like a page and a half in, and I just took the book back. I'm like, nah, I ain't doing this. I'm like, nah, I'm out. I got dragged by prison Latinas to watch them. Oh god. <laughs> mm. Well, see, that's like the only way that I might watch Twilight. And that's might because, you know, I'd probably be doing something else other than watching the movie. <laughs> I did all the cutscenes for Kushala, Teostra, and Say it's good. Gotcha, gotcha. I will never say is good, no, D, because it's not. Twilight is no bueno. I remember back at high school, <clears throat> there was a, uh, oh, oh. I think like from the second one was when they found a man in a porta potty and they called him the shit man the barbarian. That's actually that's a little funny, but and this girl in class she was doing it on the Twilight books, and like when she was giving book reports, it didn't sound bad. I was like, you know what, this story actually sounds kind of cool. Like, I'm a little into it. Uh, that was before they like became movies and they really blew up. And she would always walk around with the Twilight book. And then uh, the movies came out, and then I heard what they were about, and I was like, oh. Oh, no, this sucks. <laughs> <laughs> there's an Erd tree to our northeast. And there's a finger reader. Finger reader. Oh, Read my fingers. About the finger of the reader. I don't think you want to. Well, <laughs> I mean, you feel a, me... a fucking cloud of dust might come out. So, hey, I mean, Betty White, I would have hit that. That's fine. <laughs> oh, God. Rest, rest like in peace. Fucking <laughs> 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 just, just, just opens up and you just hear. <laughs> just like, uh, just like it I didn't coughs. hear anything, but not. <laughs> oh, it just fucking coughs. Michael said, um, now nah, read Empire of the Damned by Jake Kristoff if you like vampires. And he reads a lot of books, so I can attest. Go I remember a time when I used to like books. What yeah, I used to read books. I, I read, I think it was a 400 page book in a day. I just sat there and read the whole thing. Oh my god. I How? believe it was Tangerine. If I'm not yeah, was, I remember back in the day when I was in fifth grade, I, I was reading at a college, a college level. Oh yeah, I can still and, read pretty well. And then like, uh, then they made me do the fucking thing oh. where I had to read a book a week and God. take a little fucking test on it every week. So and I, yeah, and I stopped reading books. Yep. Yeah. As soon as you made me do it, I said, fuck you. Yep. Exactly. Because then I just started skimming through the books to find the oh, what were probably going to be the answers for the, right. the test. Mm -hmm. And then I would just do that and then I stopped actually reading the book. Yep. Same. <laughs> and That's I just... 
I took on the challenge, right, in European history, which is an AP history class in my high school, right? They did one for each continent and, like, some special shit. Um, there was, like, a book reading section of that, and they were like, so there are certain books that if you give a fucking oral report on, you'll get a certain grade, and then you can give a, riv a written one that'll give you a slightly lower grade. Um, and depending on the, the difficulty of the book, you get a better grade overall, yada, yada. And they're like... You can get an automatic 99 in the class for the entire semester without doing any other work if you do War and Peace. And I was like, <laughs> bet. Let's I, go. I could not read the first page. My brain hurt <laughs> so bad that it's so dry. There's no context. There, there's, no, there's no nothing to it. It's like if you took a nice New York strip took all the fat and marbling out of it, took the fucking moisture out of it, and then took the steak out of the steak. What do you have left? Nothing. Yes. <laughs> I don't know what was on there. I read the first page. It was only a half print, like, or like by half the page had fucking print on it. I read it seven times that I did not understand what the fuck it was talking about. Nah, you you want to read a book that you have no fucking idea? Read House of Leaves. That sounds like some I, fuck shit. I don't know if you've heard of this book. Mm -hmm. It is not a normal book because the whole book is about like this house that's going weird and like physics are breaking, and the book reflects that with chunks of text missing, chunks of text being cut out, rotated ninety degrees, and put back in, random words being overlaid over other words. Uh, pages being blank, pages being completely overlaid over another page, pages upside down, words written diagonally and backwards. Like, shit goes crazy in House of Leaves. Yeah, I'm gonna just burn Someone it. just jump. Hi. Ah, fuck. Get okay. Oh, no, you have to jump. Ah. I didn't jump. You just got unlucky. <laughs> 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 You guys believe you know, said that Fifty Shades of Grey was originally an AO3 fanfic of Twilight characters that the author stole and changed the names of the characters. Oh yeah, no, I've heard that. I've heard plenty of people say that. I don't know any of the words that just came out of your face, but sure, I'll believe it. <laughs> hey, yep. <laughs> uh, Fifty Shades of Grey oh. was originally Twilight fanfiction. Oh, uh, that explains okay. why it sucks. Eh. Oh, I didn't take any damage. Nice. Like I said, I had what to do accelerated reader as well, but because I already read a lot, I would just take tests for books, read multiple at a time, and turn them in each month. Nah, that shit would piss me off if I couldn't read something like that. <laughs> I'd rage rip it apart. You guys should read House of Leaves. I'm actually thinking about reading it myself, because that shit seems wacky as fuck. What the fuck am I hearing over here? Um, trust me, it looks worse. Whoa, what the fuck is that? Ooh. What is that? I don't know, but they they spit curses. Shit, can you guys pull them away? I can't I can't quite see them. What yeah. the fuck? There we go. I'm not gonna get a chance to shoot one. Got it! You got it by splash damage, it doesn't count. <laughs> <laughs> okay, right, there's more up ahead if you wanna actually Ooh, okay. handle right, some. Cool. Move out of way! There's two over there, there's two to the left, and then there's two straight ahead. Alright, let's see what this is. How the hell did I miss that? Oh, damn, he's quick. Oh, Lord, he's quick as hell. It's like the strain on fucking FX or some shit, but in game. Oh, I'm getting cursed. I'm dead. He got cursed. And a oh my god, he got stabbed. God, look at this. That came out of the ground and threw my butthole. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I forgot which one. Which one is that? Like rot or? It was oh, death. Death, some or shit. Is that one just death? Death, some shit. Yeah. <laughs> that was unpleasant. Uh, I've heard so much about House of Leaves, like good and bad, and it's controversial, some shit. I haven't looked into it, but I'm curious to know what's up with it. Right, that too. Warm face, they deal death blight. Oh, death blight. Yeah. <laughs> Straight death. 
Ah. Ah. Oh my god, there's death everywhere. Yeah, it definitely, uh. definitely stacked pretty quick when they both spit on you. <laughs> Ow! Well, I mean, you should be happy about that. You normally gotta pay extra. I am not happy about that. I wouldn't pay anything for that. <laughs> I haven't read much this week, but I'm already reading Can a 1500 mean? page book and have other things already planned after. Ah, oh, fair enough. No, read the leaves. Have some read the leaves. It. I'd rather read one, actual leaves. There was one story I remember reading when I was younger, uh, like in high school. Um, I don't remember the name of it, but it was an old Western book about a, a group of like cowboys, like a family. They're all named the Sackets. And it's, each book is like a different Sacket and their story. I don't remember the name of the book, but I read like mm. fucking 12 of them bitches. Yeah, I never really like had the chance to get into reading because I started to read shit when they started to make you read shit, and I was like, yeah, no, I hate this. So, <laughs> you guys want a piece of that? Piece of what? Look right ahead, dead ahead. Oh. Ah. Oh. Um. What is that? That is, uh, that is big boy. Um, there's two of them, like, coughing at the wall. Oh, said good luck. I hear an ash. Good em luck. <laughs> oh, they're, they're just, they're just bigger versions of the little ones. Good em luck. Worm face. Worm face. <laughs> Give me those crinkles. <laughs> good name. Good name. Is there are bosses, I don't have a health bar. Ah, ah, they are bosses and they are health bars. They're taking a lot of damage. They're taking a fuck of damage. Oh, death! Oh, death rains! God! These soldiers are going oh. ham on these slugs. Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Oh, shit! I'm coming! <laughs> I got one's attention! <laughs> I'm biting his king and look at Chihuahua! Oh no, he grabbed me! He's I'm eating get... me! Oh, it's I'm poop! I have become you good. fertilizer! Casper's dead! Oh, it, ate, it just actually swallowed him. Yeah, it, it, it ate me him. and spit it me into the trees. <laughs> Fuck. Oh my god. How but, are you looking over there? I'm respawning. Uh, he's respawning, so he's kind of stuck, but... Oh god, oh he's looking at me. Oh he's looking at me. Oh please stop oh, looking shit. at me. Uh, get away from me! <laughs> get away from me! Oh my oh, god, I spawned him right here! What is he doing? Oh he just what slammed I... his face in the floor. What if I just run over here? Will you he actually follow me? <laughs> oh my god, they're so fast! <laughs> oh okay, he doesn't even <laughs> He's just fucking walking faster than I can sprint, holy ah, shit! Ah, no! <laughs> Gasper, <for> help! <laughs> Gasper! Where are you? I'm coming! Get off me! <laughs> Alright, now I can do the damage. Hey, you guys almost got that one. Uh oh. He's about to burst! I'm doing drive by us! Run! Let's run! Ah! It's like trying to take down a fucking AT AT. <laughs> I'm an A wing with a dream, let's go! <laughs> oh god, oh god. Dingling! Please don't do it. <laughs> Fuck you! Who's this random motherfucker? Get out of here! I need a tripwire! I'll take one down by the, by the feetsies! Oh, oh god, please don't get Oh my god! god. Oh, He's super shit. sprinted! Yeah! Right, we got one, we got one! Fuck that guy! Oh, he's just raining death. Retreat! <laughs> Fuck you! Ah. I'm dead. Fuck! Oh. I'm dead. I'm dead. Yep. No! No! <laughs> he spit that death blade so fucking far. Oh my god. Yeah, it's, it's best to run sideways when you fight this guy. Uh, spitters for quitters. <laughs> Alright, ah. yeah, just me and you. I'm running out of mana though, so... 
It's fine. This I'm an A-wing. I got this. I'm a Y-wing. <laughs> <laughs> like, why the hell are you still? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Fuck you. Eat shit. Oh, He's fucking break dancing. What the fuck? <laughs> Get the hell out of here with your spinner Rooney. Oh shit. Oh, what? To die right now. My sword just swung through his oh, ass oh, oh, oh. and it did nothing. Oh, I hit him in a dig. Ow! Ow! What the <laughs> fuck? Soldiers, kill the dickhead! Thank you. I think our soldiers are dead, aren't they? Or do you still have some left? Uh, I still got one. Oh, uh, mine are all dead. <laughs> Hiya! Fuck this oh, those bitch. guys died. You killed some of my fucking uh, mana potions. That's it. Hell yeah. That shit like scrapes my back when he does that. <laughs> <laughs> back shot! Fuck you! Let's go! First Woo! try. Get fucked. Hell yeah. Fuck you, worm face. I still have one soldier left. Hell yeah. Ooh, crimson spill. Speckle. Hmm. Res me. Oh, yeah, where's me? A Kaladin Sunflower. Yeah, they're just little mana dudes. We little mana guys. It's this way. Oh, uh, it's up on the bridge. Oh, it's that one. Right. Yeah. I guess it's teleport to the bridge? Uh, oh, we can't because it's fucking uh, spray. Yeah, yeah, it's true. True. Okay, all right. Well, we got to find another one then. Let's just go north, straight north. Got it. Since you, guys, since you guys are talking about books, I was trying to remember the one book that I really liked. I can't remember Spirit the fucking name. game in college. Oof. Yeah, there's one I read back in the day called the the Westing game. The Westing. That one was pretty cool. It was a um, a who done it. Ah, okay. Oh. And so like you were trying to figure out who the fuck did it. Mm. And I remember it being pretty good. I remember that one was telling. There was one, there's a couple books that I've read that I can't remember the titles of, but there was one specifically that was about this guy going, oh, uh, see, uh, oh, uh, this guy no, going, we, we, pa we passed it, passed the grace. Yeah. Where's that? It um, it is this way. Maybe. Ruins with more worm faces inside. Uh. Hello? I can't even open my map, so I don't know where you guys are trying to go. <laughs> I don't know where Casper is. I don't fucking see it. I don't know. It's we, called the stack of we can, oh, okay. We can go north, northeast. Okay. I heard it when I was in school, but I didn't really care for westerns. Fair enough. Never read a whole Who Done It type book, but I like those type of movies. Absolutely love Knives Out movie. <clears throat> yeah, so there was one where this this guy, it's like this older dude and this younger guy go out to the desert for some reason, and the older guy knocks the younger guy out, like sticks him up on this giant rock as like a death game, and he's like, "You have to get down from there, and they're like I'll kill you or some shit," and it's a whole like, "Will he make it off the mountain before the guy reaches it?" Hmm. Uh, that just sounds weird. Friends. I'm explaining it really weird, but it was really good. <laughs> and then the other one I think is called Hatchet, where the guy is in a plane crash. <gasps> yeah. Oh, that one's really Hatchet. good. That one's really so good. good. Hatchet's so good. Yeah, that one was fucking great. I very much enjoyed Hatchet. I still, I still remember like there was two times where the motherfucker almost died because like <laughs> the one of the ones I remember because uh one where he made he was trying to make a bow. And he grabbed a piece of wood that was too dry, and so it snapped, mm -hmm. and it hit him right next to the eye. And so the whole mm -hmm. time he was saying like to himself, he's like, "Motherfucker!" Like, almost just fucked up so guys, bad man. that I almost just blinded myself. Like that is that is some stupid <laughs> shit. Yeah. Don't do that again. Mm -hmm. And then uh, the other time he got a fucking skunk into the eyeballs. <laughs> mm. And he skunk's also got right in the fucking eye. Shot in mm -hmm. the leg with the uh, porcupine quills. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I remember that. Yeah. Also, this is the, the village where the skin guy was, right? 
Yeah. Yeah. Like, yeah, it's like because one one of the books I'm trying to remember is one of my favorite ones. I don't remember if it was called like the Gifter. Uh, wait, uh, come to me, spray. I'm taking the tree with the seed. Where are you? At? To your left, I think. Oh, I see. Okay, sorry. Continue. Yeah, it was like I think, I think it was called the Gifter. Um, it's like the, one of these utopian society type things. And you slowly, it slowly starts to show you how it's utopian and why it's not good, like behind the scenes. Because mm -hmm. like all the normal people and everything, they're all they're all chilling. They don't know what the fuck's going on, so their lives are just good. And uh, it's kind of weird, but like it's it's cool to see the world that they have set up. And then uh, there's one dude who's pretty much the reason that why everyone's happy is because one motherfucker is taking on every other emotion besides happy. Oh, I remember mm. that. Like the kid, he can see colors, right? And then he's chosen as the next one. Yeah, because he sees flashes of he doesn't even know what the fuck it was yeah, he doesn't until know later you see that it was colors. Because everyone sees in black and white. I remember that. Everyone's saying it's called The Giver. The Giver. That's what it is. That, that, was so that, book, good. I, that book is fucking good. I enjoyed the shit out of that one. And then uh, it was really cool. I just no way in hell I'm gonna remember the name, but there's uh, I think there's three books in this series, and they're all from a different village or different town in that same world. Ooh, okay. hmm. And there's another one. Uh, it might have been like the singer or something like that, because it's completely about um, like uh, singing the song of the ancients or whatever, and it's like this old school village. Where if you go outside the village, you get eaten by, uh, like, crazy beasts and shit and whatever. It sounds like The Village, but I'm not Shyamalan. <laughs> Kinda. <laughs> but, uh, there's a, there's this one girl, the main girl, who's, um... She has, like, a, a fucked up leg, like, from birth. Mm -hmm. And so no one even wanted her to be alive to begin with, because they were like, No, she's just gonna slow us down, we should've just killed her. For one reason or another, they left her alone, and she ends up... Uh, again with one of not like the superpower but you know one of those where she was gifted in some way yeah. and she ends up saving motherfuckers and doing all that gotcha gotcha but it was cool uh, to see how it how it tied into the giver yeah uh Michael just said only learned recently <sighs> the giver is a series but never read the others I didn't know that and then Hyena said, tell me about Hatchet Mr. Chair have you never heard Hatchet Hyena oh, oh, Hatchet's so good Hatchet's so it's some good. kid I forget what he's doing I think he's gonna go visit one of his parents or something but he's basically in a small plane with just him and the pilot. And midway through flight, the pilot has a heart attack and they crash. Well, the pilot dies and the kid is somewhere in like some wilderness. And so he has uh, to survive. Canadian. Canadian, Canadian wilderness. wilderness. So he has to survive. And like he runs into all kinds of trouble. He gets like an infection. He gets stabbed by porcupine, porcupine quills. Uh, like, all kinds of shit happens to this kid. And then like, you know, it's a survival story. So he actually, he gets out. And then he talks about how going back to like normal life doesn't feel right to him anymore. Hmm. Like doing all the normal things that kids do his age, he's like, none of it is right. <laughs> and the, the reason it's called it's Hatchet wrong. was because one I of mean, the survival hey. tools, one of the only survival tools he had I'm through the whole thing bro. was an actual like ouch, legit hatchet. Everything else was whatever he could get his hands on. They got uh, hammers. I don't, I don't know what y'all are fighting over there. Why don't you have that? I don't know. There's, Maybe there, they'll give me one. There's goodies over oh, here. And I, I forgot to level. Oh. I have 58,000 on me. <laughs> oh, God. It's cool. You can come back and grab them. I almost I'm, got one all right, I'm, I'm going to come help you guys, but y'all definitely got to go get those goodies I just found. Never heard of Hatchet either, but that's because I'm primarily a fantasy sci-fi reader. Fair enough. Oh, please don't. No! <laughs> I have 41,000 on me. <laughs> one, one thing I liked about the, the hatchet shit, too is when he goes back and I think he went to the library because that was still a fucking thing. He went to the <laughs> library to look up the stuff that he was dealing with, like the area that he was in and the animals. Because he came up with his own names for the animals and he wanted to see what they were actually named. It was just, it was just like a, a fun little, fun little uh, thing to have. Oh, one is almost dead. There was one dead. So there's another book. Um, 
And it's about this kid who goes out like on a camping trip. And he goes with like his family and like, he has, I think he has like a stepdad and they don't really get along. And so they're just kind of going out and he goes out on his camping trip. And he doesn't want to be near them. So he goes to like the other side of like their campfire and he finds this, it's like a big rock overhang with a little, there's like barely enough room to crawl Ooh. under it. And he's like, this is really like cozy. Oh damn, I got all their clothes. Hell yeah, I got it twice. Yeah, twice over. Yeah. And Did so you get their weapon? Really close? Uh, I don't think so. Mm, so this is no. really cozy, so he sleeps under it. Uh, unfortunately, when he sleeps under it, he gets semi-possessed by the spirit of a Native American who was killed there. Uh, and the Native American wants to, like he, he wants hey, his hey, area where he died turn. to not be disturbed because he moved the skull. Turn. And when he found the skull, he picked it up because he was like, oh, cool skull. And so it's all about the kid, like, whenever he goes to sleep, he has dreams of Native Americans and things like that. And then he has to slowly piece together what happened, because the little Indian boy got executed. And so the, the kid has to find out who did it. And when he figures mm. it out and he returns the skull, he basically puts the, the Indian boy's spirit to rest. And in doing so, he, like, fixes his family's life and all those, like, the issues with his mom and his dad or his stepdad. No, fuck his family. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a lot of rats. That is a lot of rats. There's two big fatties, too. Ah, oh, fuck God. me. I almost got stuck in there. He dropped the rune arc? Oh, is that... Is that a nod to when they fucking dropped humanities? <laughs> fucking rats. Uh, I'm guessing that's what that is. I don't... Hey, I don't we... think there's another reason they would do that. We definitely got to go back to that original uh, windmill that I was standing over by. You guys ran up on me just standing there. Because there's some goodies over there. The that single windmill? Yeah. Okay. Like 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 to the to the east. I'm down. Yeah. I guess we're Lord of the Flies. I have not. I'm actually not entirely sure what it's about. Uh, Isn't that one super fucked up? Yeah, that one's mad fucked up. Like, just ridiculously fucked. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, that's the one where all the kids are fucking stranded on the island and shit. And they, like, come up with their own form of government and it turns into an absolute shit show. Yeah, immediately. Yeah. <laughs> right. No, but I heard there's a really cheesy movie made of it. Ah. Yeah, it's really bad. Like, just actually quality bad. And doesn't really do a lot of what the book does, which is kind of typical, but like worse than normal. So. Fair enough. Yeah. Uh, rats have a one percent, and giant rats have a three percent chance to drop them. Oh, do you know another book that was really fucking good? Uh, I thought I thought it was really really good. Uh, I know they made a movie of it. I never wanted to see it. Uh, I think the movie came out like 2018. Uh, Wrinkle in Time. I remember that one, that the name, really but I don't remember reading it. Yeah, I'd say the name sounds familiar. Lawnmower! But yeah, I remember seeing that the movie was going to come out, and I was like, ha, fuck that. <laughs> <laughs> no, thank you. Uh, I'm trying yeah. to remember other books that I've read. I, Storm was a good one. I remember reading the Ink series, but I don't remember what it was about. I just remember it was fucking fantasy and magic and stuff. <laughs> but I remember there's liking that, them. There's that one fantasy book. It's like a fantasy sci-fi about uh, dragons and people raising dragons to like dragon cockfight, basically. I I fucking I read like the first book in high school. Couldn't find the the name of the series. I found the name of the series like a couple of years ago, and I started reading them again, and then I lost the the name of the series. <laughs> Rip. But like this kid, he finds this one dragon because he's like a slave, and you can buy your freedom if you have enough money. So he works with this dragon tamer, and he's he's in charge of taking care of like the baby dragons. And um, he finds one that has like really long wings, and they're like, "Nah, this one's a defect. We're gonna throw it away." So instead of throwing it away, he steals it and hides it away somewhere, and he slowly raises it and trains it, and then he uses that dragon to help him get out of slavery. I know it's probably ink not, oh. but it's not. Ink heart? Yeah, ink oh, heart, like... ink spell, ink death. Um, I, I, I remember liking those, but I don't remember what they were. 
I was like gosh. fucking seven or eight when I read them or some shit. <laughs> Nine. They're pretty good. Yeah. I just remember he has to cut open the dragon because it's like a tauntaun situation where if they don't, they're going to mm. freeze to death. Yeah. So they, the dragon dies, they cut it open, sleep inside of it, and him and his girlfriend gain psychic powers with the dragons. A little weird, mm -hmm. but it's fantasy. What can you expect? Yeah. <laughs> Um, I need to find a grace. I have 55,000. I do not want to die. I've got 71. Oh my god. Please, Lord, help me. What'd you do, Casper? I fear for your runes. Oh. Who's this? All right, then. Why do I hear... Yeah, he die. Why am I hearing oh, there's more of those demon boars? Oh, that's, that's the worm I mean. Yeah, okay. Two of um, the best books I was forced to read in school were Frankenstein in 1984. Frankenstein was really good. I don't know 1984. Uh, there's a little caravan to our southwest. You guys want to go hit that and get the little chest in the in the carriage oh. thing? Before that, there's uh, those golden ash beetles to our east. I can't tell if they're red, but they just look gold. Uh, hey, OG, yeah, who's that is this just guy? gold. Who's sad sunflower man? I think we could just jump down. Nah, I'm not taking that risk. That's a m we can. mad big jump. Yeah, you could just fall right down. You don't even take damage. I don't know. After what I went through on Horizon Zero Dawn the other day, I'm, I'm not trusting no <laughs> fucking cliffs nowhere. Alright. Oh, they're running! Shit! We got a runner! We got runners! We got them! Protection of the Earth Tree! Mm. Sold! What the fuck does that one do? <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's. Fucking find out. Some of the Burian guys counselor had a meeting with my mom. Is that a check out all the scary stuff? Increases affinity damage negation for self and allies. I don't know what the fuck that means. So, what is affinity? Like, so you like scary shit? Increases damage negation for all affinity. But that's psych issues. Oh, I think that's just all damage. Like, it reduces all damage. I hate guidance counselors because they think they know more than what they do. Great, but it's not too bad. And they use it as more depends how much. And it sucks. They're just a bunch true, of pretentious true. dicks. Furry visual novels Keep is the only thing we've done. <laughs> Furry visual novels. Oh god, there's some weird slugs below us. Is this his name? The Noble Gold Mask. Wait, what if I put on... Because we got a noble outfit. Oh, the... The fucking... The dude, the guy who sells uh, incantations, he's looking for the Noble Gold Mask, I think. I just uh -oh. talked to him over here on this bridge. Where is he? Yeah, the noble gold mask is up here on top of the bridge. He's the one that's just sitting there. Yeah, where is this guy? I think it's this guy over here. Yeah, Brother Corhin. Correct, yes, Brother Corhin over here. I think if we talk to him, we can tell him that we found the noble gold mask. Do we go back to the round table? No, he left the round table. He's just down south. Like, if you go straight south and then a little bit west to the Altis Highway Junction, he's directly north of that. Hmm. Oh, that junction. guy. Yeah. Yeah. yeah he was talking about the, the noble dude. And Gandalf just saying, correct. <laughs> <laughs> correct. 1984 is like a dystopian sci-fi book by George Orwell. Oh, I've heard of that book. Well, technically, Where I think it's they? classified as sci-fi, but I don't really think it's... <laughs> Ah, what the ch f fuck off, dog? Where the hell did you come from? <laughs> oh my god. If you do this quest, you get the gold mask armor. Nice. Ugh. Fucking hate dogs. Thank you, Panda, for another 10 bitties. Oh, I appreciate it. Yeah. So this is the Altus Highway Junction? Yeah. On Southwest. Alright, I got him. Alright. <laughs> we dropped something. No! <laughs> the item! You're basically naked with his mask. Nice. Uh, I 
I do read a lot of like web comics. There's some pretty good ones. Uh, Boxer was really fucking good, and it ended too, and it has a nice ending. So, if anyone wants to read a good visual novel, Boxer is a really good one. Oh, something has a good ending. That's crazy. Yeah. No, it actually has like, it's not great, but as far as endings go, I was like, okay, you know, it wrapped up like every plot point. Sick. Hmm. It's just about a, a kid who went through so much trauma when he was younger that now nothing means anything to him hmm. and time moves a little slower for him than everyone else and so he doesn't know what the fuck to do it's just, it's just like what is life oh, and this no, really I'm fucked up I'm boxing doing. coach takes advantage of that fact and uses him to beat the shit out of other people it's real fucked up may the golden hmm. order shine through i don't sport with you yeah, I don't have time to read anything. I can barely read the words on a game screen anymore. <laughs> like I'm going to read or I'm going to learn great he Oh wait no, I'm saving up for a level up. Don't do that. Okay. I could learn great heal and never use it. <laughs> it costs more than half of my FP. Jesus. Wait, if I use these that's not gonna be enough. Yes, they can see never. I hear Monster Pulse. Oh, I read Monster Pulse. That was good. Cool, cool. I tried a couple times to get into comics and manga, but I just can't get into them. I mean, fair, fair enough. Uh, okay, so I think we either talk to the Gold Mask again, or we just head off and continue our game. I have no idea. I've never done this. Me either. Let's go. I mean, we might as well do it then. Yeah, back up to the windmill village then. 